Hello! From concept to production, designing a PCIe 5.0 device requires a long development cycle owed largely to heavy efforts on verification and validation. Today, a large collection of tools enables simulation to find bugs during the verification process or to generate PCIe transactions to validate the device. However, these tools are not enough to provide 100% confidence before a device can go to production, for one main reason. All these tests and simulations were not done in a real hardware environment. That's why we created Inspector for PCIe 5.0 Interposer Cards for Diagnostic Testing, Exercising and Debug of PCIe 5.0 Devices. Inspector is a unique tool which uses transparent switching technology that allows itself to be plugged between your device under test, DUT, and a regular host platform. Designed as an interposer, Inspector has been made to enhance your host capabilities with easy low power mode, including L1 substates and PCIe 5.0 32 gigabit per second support. It provides test and measurement in a real environment. Inspector can be used at several steps of your development cycle. During the prototyping phase, when you need to check if your device behaves as defined in specifications. During the bring-up phase, when you need to test how your device works in its final environment, whether server, client or other system and during the production phase when you need to accelerate your test bench development and proceed to fast and effective validation. Let's have a look at the features that can be used during the prototyping phase. The link status validation enables you to check if the device under test links as expected. LTSSM, a stable link, will prove the DUT state machine meets the PCI SIG specifications, while LTSSM Unstable Link will show when and where the instability begins. In the Equalization section, you can check if the equalization phases have passed or not. You can see which presets have been negotiated and if those were expected or not. Inspector enables dynamic local or remote preset changes. You can change the link speed and link width. You can enter and exit low power modes automatically. And all the above diagnostic features can be executed manually or with easy Python scripts. Please visit rambus.com for more information. Thanks for watching.